quite a bit of cloud coverage since yesterday. So that continues on this morning. Uh, it's moved all the way out to the high desert as well. So this is overlooking our Palmdale camera. It's a really beautiful shot here. Temperatures in some of the mountains that are outside of it. Uh, 66 over into Lancaster, but it's still cool up into Big Bear at about 63. Most areas are mild in the upper 60s to low 70s, but there's still a couple spots where it's pretty cool. Hemant, 62 degrees as well as Beaumont, about 64 degrees over into Santa Clarita. Our high temperatures today are going to be even cooler than yesterday. Yes, it is going to be feeling like fall, uh, but some temperatures pretty close to where we should be for early December today. <laughs> so things are shifting quite a bit. It's going to get a little warmer over the weekend, though. We'll more on that in just a little bit. Philip, Javon, I'll send it back to you. Okay, we'll see you then. Brianna, thank you. Long a lot of cloud coverage out there today. Um, the only places that are really outside of it are the high desert, the low desert, and then some of the mountain communities. So it's pretty overcast. And aside from the marine layer clouds, we also have some other clouds that we'll be talking about moving in tomorrow as well. So it's feeling like fall and it's feeling like late. Uh, we've got a nice little onshore push and it's pushing some of those clouds in and it is really helping us cool off. Aside from that, we do have some winds that are picking up. Most of it's out to the east. And so we do have the wind advisory that's in place for the high desert. I'll see you about 9 o'clock tonight where we'll see some gusts getting close to about isolated 50, but closer to about 30 mile per hour winds. And now all of this is changing because we have this low pressure that's dropping down from Canada. This is a cold low as well, and it's going to be moving right over Nevada. And then after that, we're going to have a little ridge that's going to pop in tomorrow. That's going to help us warm up. However, we do have another tropical storm off the coast of Baja. Uh, this is tropical storm Kenneth. And as it continues to move north, you can see this cloud coverage and this plume is still moving into Baja. As we head into tomorrow, it's going to be moving into Southern California. So we will still have quite a bit of cloud coverage. There'll be high clouds, but we'll also be dealing with the marine layer, low clouds in the morning. So we'll see some clouds on and off here over the weekend because of that tropical system. We'll still be warming up. That's going to continue on the next few nights. So we're still going to be dealing with some very chilly nights for the higher elevations. Afternoons, we'll start to get a little bit more mild. Today's going to be on the cool side. So sweater weather for the mountains today. Friday, Saturday, mid up we head into the weekend. Temperatures really not too bad for us over the next week, Philip and Giovanna. Okay, Brianna, thank you. As soon as possible, he is a total sweetheart. A good morning. It's gloomy outside. It's not feeling like September at all here in Southern California, but uh, that's kind of the way it's been this year with our weather, so it continues. Downtown LA right now, it is overcast. It's mild, though. It's about 72 degrees. There's some spots a little warmer than others, but that's about it. Those warmer spots, mostly in the 70s. Elsewhere, we're seeing some 60s. Long Beach right now, it's about 70 and it's cloudy and you can see all that three degrees. We do have a wind advisory in place. It's a little breezy out there for some spots like Santa Clarita, but especially over into the high desert. And then we do have some isolated gusts up to about 45 miles per hour possible. Most winds right around 30, though. And then if you are in some of the lower, all of this is changing because we've got this huge low that dropped down from Canada. It's a cold low, and it's going to be moving right over Nevada today. So this is looking at the atmosphere later this afternoon. But take a look at what happens as we head into tomorrow. We do have a little ridge that's going to move on in, and as it does, it's going to help our Temperatures warm up. We'll get to some back to mid 70s for downtown LA tomorrow, but you'll see all this cloud coverage and you'll notice that, and that's due to a tropical storm that we have off the coast of Baja, Tropical Storm Kenneth. It's right now that cloud plume is moving over Baja, but by tomorrow, the storm will continue to move out to the north and to the west, and as it does, uh, that in Encino. All feeling pretty mild though 67 Santa Clarita, 68 in Northridge, just 66 in Thousand Oaks, and about 72 in Simi. Lock to 80 tomorrow, and then some mid 80s and 80s pretty much over the next week. Guys, I'll send it back to you. All right, Brianna, thank you. DC7 traffic alert, and it's going to be until about 6 o'clock this morning. It's over into the downtown LA area. It's on the 55 northbound, so just a heads up, that's going to be shut down until at least about 6 o'clock. We will keep you updated, though, throughout the morning. John, Leslie, Rachel, I'll send it back to you. All right, Brianna, thank you. Encino Sherman Oaks area and heading into Bel Air. Temporarily, all lanes are stopped, but we had a fatal accident here, unfulfortunately, just a little while ago on the 405 South. It's right at Mulholland, and this is really going to back your drive up. Soon, they're going to just have two lanes that will be blocked off. However, they're not expecting to have those reopen until closer to about 7 o'clock this morning. So if this is your commute before 7 o'clock, I would go a different route. I would make sure you leave early. You have Sepulveda Boulevard to down to Mulholland, and we'll continue to keep you updated on that. It is the worst spot out there, and I think it will be uh, for a little while here. All right, John, Leslie, Rachel, I'll send it back to you. All right, Bree, thank you for the update. <laughs>